the six nationalists who were arrested in 1952 was Acheng Oneko. He was the only non-Kikuyu leader among the heroes who were eventually detained in these cells. Consequently, he was isolated from the other five, Jomo Kenyatta, Kungu Karumba, Hongei, Gilded Kagia, and Fred Kubai. Acheng Oneko was not held in the same space, in the same block, next to the rest. Uh, and according to this, they say he was not held in the same block as the others. As a Luo with little knowledge of the Kikuyu language, he could not have participated in the rituals. It was therefore impossible to link him to the Mao Mao. Subsequently, he was put in a separate cell. And this cell that I'm standing in today was reconstructed since the previous one was destroyed as per the details given by Oneko. So he's the one who shared the details of where he was and this cell was reconstructed. Here in Kapenguria, where today the national colors fly over independent Kenya, in 1953, Mzee Kenyatta and his comrades in arms were put on trial by the colonial government. During the trial, Oneko was charged as accuser number three. After they were convicted, all six appealed the conviction. The judges found that Oneko had in large part been convicted on the weight of attending cow meetings. Adding that the statements at the meetings were mostly in Kikuyu, hence a problem for him to understand at the time. Although the judges acquitted him of the charges on 15th January 1954, he remained in detention with the other Kapenguria 6 members, being released in 1961.